Hello, it's John Bauman with another calculation of gross domestic product. In this example, we're going to calculate nominal gross domestic product in an economy where we assume there are only two products, smartphones and microwave ovens. So here is the information that is given in the problem. In this economy, we are making 10 smartphones at $200 each, 5 microwave ovens at $300 each, two pounds of glass and steel to help make the phones in the microwave ovens, these are intermediate products, at $40 per pound, 15 microchips to help make both products at $20 per chip. Depreciation is $50 and the possible answers are below for how much nominal GDP should be. So if you want to look at those answers and do the calculation, you can pause the video and see uh, which answer is the correct one. Okay, so here comes the explanation. Let's take a look at all these items. Uh, first of all, we see smartphones. These are final products, so we are, are going to include them in the calculation of GDP. Microwave ovens are also final products, so we will include them. Now, what about the glass and the steel? They're intermediate products, and according to the definition of GDP, we do not include them. So, we will take this and put it aside. We're not going to use them in the calculation of GDP. How about the microchips? Also an intermediate product, so we don't need them. I push them aside. Depreciation. Well, what we're doing with the smartphones and the microwave ovens, we're using the expenditure approach. Depreciation is really a component in the income approach. If you remember from the textbook, the income approach involves six components. Wages, interest, rent, profit, indirect business taxes, and depreciation. And depreciation is one of those six components in the income approach. But we don't have those income components, wages, interest, rent, so we can't use that. So right now, depreciation is really irrelevant. So it really just leaves us, using the expenditure approach, with the value of the smartphones and the microwave ovens at $200 each. And as you can see, the value of the smartphones is 10 times 200. So that's... 2000 and the microwave ovens 5 times 300 and that's 1500 so if you add the two together you get 2000 plus 1500 and as you can see the correct answer then is choice B well, I was trying to try to circle that but it's not letting me so choice B, 1500, 2000 plus 1500 is the total nominal GDP. If you were to ask, uh, if the question were to ask what is a net domestic product, and a net domestic product is gross domestic product minus depreciation. For net domestic product, the answer would be 3500 minus 50 depreciation, it would be 3450. But here we're asking for uh, gross domestic product, and uh, so it's 3500.